Omnicurus, India's largest online CME platform, in collaboration with API, bringing you the accredited latest digital CME on gastroparesis related GERD challenges and effective management. What are the uh, effects? The pressure gradient goes up and this pressure correlates with body mass index as well as waist circumference and therefore there is an increased strain on the anti-reflux barrier and there is a higher risk of hiatus hernia. If you tell these patients to lose just a small quantity of weight even if it is 4 to 8 kgs or maybe about 10% of their body weight their symptoms really reduce and if this obesity is treated by surgery or by balloons or by endoscopic means there are multiple studies that show that patients do improve and therefore these people may have uh, better uh, qualities of life after they improve their weight. So from weight we move to diet. Now many factors in the diet are associated with increase in symptoms. Many of these are fatty food, spicy food, aerated drinks. What aerated drinks do is they release carbon dioxide in the stomach. This carbon dioxide increases the gastroesophageal uh, pressure gradient and therefore opens the LES and some of the uh, acid material can then come up. So aerated drinks like fizzy drinks, excessive amounts are known to increase the gastroesophageal reflux in patients who are sensitive. Low intake of fruits is also one of the risk factors. For more videos, download the Omnicurus app.